Hello, sir. John from Extermapest. Oh, for Christ. But what's the exact nature of your problem? The dispatcher wasn't very clear. It's scientists. I mean, I've tried to ignore them, but it's just getting silly now. Scientists, you say? Yeah, I mean, I've put poisons down, but they just keep taking a sample, emphasising the antidote, and drinking it to mock me. Sounds like you've got chemists, sir. You see, what happens is they have their funding slashed and they've got nowhere else to go. You've got ICI around the back here, ain't you? They're more than likely coming in through holding the fence. You tried putting down traps? Again, I put down traps where they just take them apart, make them more efficient and leave them around the house. I nearly fell into a black hole the other day getting out of bed. Well, let's have a look. Oh, yes. I can see where they've been. Through here, Ollie. Get me on the sofa, do they, sir? Yeah. Yeah, you see, they do prefer laboratory conditions, but they'll thrive almost anywhere. Give us a hand, sir. Oh, there we go. Looks like a couple of astrophysicists and a microbiologist, mate. Haven't seen one of them in a while. What can you do? This normally works. Glaxo, Smith and Klein are up at the university. Looking to invest in the area, you say, sir? That is good news for the community. Right. While they've gone, I've got some religious paraphernalia in the van. You can stick some of that up. How's that going to help? Well, you know science and religion, sir. They just... Don't mix. Cheerio.